If you're using wireless mics or in-ear monitors, you need to be using antenna distribution to get the best performance out of your wireless. Our friends at RFN, you have some new devices that are going to help you make sure your wireless is rock solid. We're here with our friend Don at RF Venue, We're looking at some new RF devices to make your wireless rock solid. Talk to us about these things, these are cool. Okay, so these are additions to our HDR line, which is our high dynamic range. Yeah. So this is our racing team stuff. Okay. This is when you need more performance than you could get with standard level stuff, which is which we also make, which right. there's nothing wrong with. There's just it's great. This is just mo better. This is just mo better. It's like you could drive a Lexus or you could drive a Toyota. Okay. Right. Okay. So so these are step ups in performance. Okay. The high dynamic range basically gets you lower intermodulation distortion buildup, which is one of the things that eventually takes you off the air. Right. So what we've done with these is the dynamic range of these boxes is about 20 dB higher okay. than standard level stuff. That means you have a 20 dB running head start before you start to develop the, the, the IMD that the other boxes right. with. So that just makes things a whole lot cleaner, which bottom line means you end up with more channel space available. Yeah. Whether you're in Times Square or you're on top of a mountain in Idaho. In either case, right. you're going to have more channels. Obviously more important than Times Square. Yeah, Idaho, I've not I've not seen a lot of RF issues in, in the middle of Idaho. Pretty well on top of that mountain in Idaho, you can do whatever you want. <laughs> Stick a coat hanger in the back of your radio, you'd be good to go. So this is our new uh, Distro 5. Okay. Uh, like our Distro 4. Um, but one better. But one better, which our Distro 4 actually has five. I don't right. know. But anyway, we finally, so uh, some new features with this, obviously the Far better performance, right. 20 dB better performance. Um, this has a this can be powered with DC. Okay. So if you have people that are living out of a camera bag, right, you can run this with with a battery. Okay. Uh, this also has so it has external power for your your receivers with 25 percent more power. Okay. Than our Distro 4 had. Awesome. With 60 uh, percent more power. Then our Distro 9 has, you ran into some issues yeah, yeah. with some devices that are, didn't have enough power. Right. That's with one of these. Okay. If you put two of these together, yeah. you essentially create a Distro 9, and you save about $300, and you more than double the power out, the DC power available. That's fantastic. Okay. And it's still one rack unit. And it's still one rack unit. So I like that, it. that's a good thing. Um, then we have our new uh, HDR, our combined six. So this is for in-ear monitors. So you can plug six transmitters into this, resolve it to a single antenna output. Yeah. But here's the cool part. But wait, there's because, more. But wait, there's more. Because the electronics are so much better, we're able to build a link into this one. You can put two of these together, uh, and like you now it. can have a 12-channel in-ear monitor system That's to a fantastic. single antenna and be rock solid with it. Now, why why five and like I'm so used to four and eight from you guys. Five and six are going to mess with my paradigm. So, that's an interesting thing. So, well, <laughs> we asked a lot of people that the, the pro with with in ear monitors, almost everybody needs more than four. Right. You know, it's like I need five. Yeah. I need six, or I need ten. Yeah. That's always with our combined eight. There's a way you can tie that stuff together, and our electronics work fine. But it wasn't well, the right number. You, you, well, you create you create <laughs> more haze. You, you yeah. create more interference, yeah. and so so this is this is a solution for that. That's awesome for for a traveling band. Yeah. You know, especially if they do fly gigs and stuff. I now can give you five mics and six ears in a single rack space of super high quality stuff, which so, covers most bands. Yeah, it yeah. does. So super super lightweight with that. Because you shouldn't um, mic the drummer. That's. No. <laughs> <laughs> you shouldn't mic the drummer, no. Um, so, um, Made in America, we're building these in Boston. Yeah. In our in our newly, giantly expanded office. Okay. Uh, that more than doubled in size for our production lines. Um, so, that helps. Uh, we all learned a little lesson in COVID about supply chains. Right, right, right. So, now that it's in-house, we have much, much better control yeah. of that. So, higher quality... Slightly expanded channel counts, pass through on, on the IEM combiner, which is fantastic. 
um, which probably means it's infinitely more money, or just a little. It's a more little money. more money. A little bit, but it's, it's a not little crazy. More it's like it's not. It's, it's not crazy. And like I said, if you were going to get a, di a Distro Nine, it's, it's actually less. three hundred dollars yeah. less. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, some really good stuff. Does it uh, hardware to be able to combine these into a rack or yeah? Rack so these? they come with a long rack here and a short rack here. If you Perfect. buy one. You got a half rack. And if you buy two, you get buy two, two You put them together, and yeah, and you can Brilliant. mix and match them however you want. I like it. So new new combiners, uh, just RF is such like every service we do, most of it is led from a wireless mic. Your pastor, your worship team, like your wireless has to be rock solid. Invest in good distro. Make sure it's rock solid. Make sure your services are great.